Alrighty. Hey! Alright, you guys, how's it going? Welcome back to another video in the Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild series. Hope you enjoyed that little uh, starting screen. And yeah, as Will Pie Plays says right here, I got 400 subs. So thank you guys so much for all the support that our channel's got in the past little while. But yeah, Korok Forest hype, guys, let's go. We are going to go to Korok Forest. After we beat this really annoying shrine that kind of killed me last time a lot. <laughs> I also hope you guys appreciate how bad I am at the original Legend of Zelda. That's what that was, by the way. In case you guys didn't know. Just thought I'd change it up because I had a little extra time before the stream started. So it had a little starting screen. Alright, what do we have here? Oh yeah, I remember the shrine. How we just cheesed it with this thing, but it actually ended up being harder than just playing it the normal way. <laughs> I remember that. So let's do it the normal way this time. Oh yeah, this isn't gonna work, is it? Yeah, I think I might just cheese the shrine again. I don't play this game ever because it never feels like a good time. I usually have a good time playing it, except I really get annoyed um, on certain shrines when I'm just playing really badly. Dang it. Oh yeah! Because plus is inventory. Stupid Animal Crossing brain. barely made it. I have a, I have a question. Uh, yes? What is your question? I want that chest. Oh, wait. We already got it. Never mind. Hey, Kira. Yeah, welcome back, Kira. Welcome back. What PC do you have? Uh, it's in the description. At somewhere. Um, it's not, it's not really any certain computer, it's just put a bunch of parts together and now it works. Again though, I am playing on my Switch right now, so. We should probably eat something, because our lonky boy is a little hungry. Let's just eat that one. Okay, what's going on here? Oh yeah, we need to power that bit. So... I might have to do this the intended way. What is that doing? Oh, it's bringing this platform over. Awesome. Should probably get up here and Magnesis my fire, my thunder blade, because I don't want to lose it. I got an Elgato for my Switch. Yeah, I've had that kind of since I started YouTubing. Is this even gonna work? Oh, it's still going. It's not gonna go anymore, is it? Can I just... Maybe power the rail like this? Can so! Don't land there! What the?! Dude, I didn't land there! Dang it. How much did it cost? It was a good, like, 200 bucks. Dang it, this is gonna take forever. Come back, platform. Sweet. Okay, give me this. Thunderblade. 
of cheesy wonderfulness. Except last time that didn't really work, so... What if I... Can I magnesis that thing from here? No, I can't. So I'm gonna have to... I'm looking for a PC and wanted your opinion. I mean, yeah, it really depends on what budget you have. I would... I'd actually recommend building my own. Because it's fun. And, yeah. It's not really as hard as it sounds. Just take a case, take a couple of components, slap them in there, and then you made something. Yay. <laughs> kind of like the kind of like making meals at Breath of the Wild how you just kind of take some things shove it into a pot and then boom you made something take me away take me away you old platform my budget is around 500 bucks yeah I'm sorry to say you can't really get much in the form of a gaming PC, or if you're looking to play like Breath of the Wild on your PC for emulation, you're gonna need to go to around probably like the mm, 1000, 1500 mark. But if you're just looking to play a couple of games like Roblox and Minecraft, you can definitely get away with $500. Come on, line up. Is it just me or is this cheesing? Is cheesing this shrine actually harder than just beating it? <laughs> I feel like I feel like that was the case, but there we go. We've done it. Let's go. PC and a monitor and a keyboard and mouse or just a laptop well the only real advantage for a desktop computer is that you're gonna get you're gonna get um like usually they're a bit cheaper because you don't have to pack it into such a space but then you have to buy all the peripherals and stuff as well but then you can always upgrade it and swap parts out like i'm thinking of getting a new hard drive that just has more space because i'm running out and then i can just put it in there where if you have a laptop you can't do that but then it's portable. If I were you, I mean it depends whether you like taking it around or not, but if I were you I'd probably get a computer because then if you get more money later then you can make it better. Because again, like I said, $500 won't really get you very far in terms of like for more advanced games. But anyway, let's see. Sign of the Shadow. I'm gonna look... I need to find, um... I need to find a statue where I can get my health. Because I have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 hearts. And we need 13 to go to Korok Forest. So, um... I'm pretty sure there's one in Kakariko. That's Kakariko? Okay. Let's head over there. Check out what we got there! Wait a second, what? My time live counter is broken. So this time I actually remembered to turn it on, but it broke. Um. There we go, I think I fixed it. Yeah, yep, yeah, fixed it. Okay. Best thing of creating a streaming series like Breath of the Wild 2 is being a computer or laptop to do it. Yeah, you do need something like that to stream. I'm pretty sure you can stream on like Xbox and PlayStation as well. But yeah, if you're gonna do a streaming series on like Breath of the Wild and stuff, then you're definitely gonna want um you're definitely gonna want to uh get a capture card as well. Or just a good enough computer to emulate it. But then there's glitches and stuff. Okay peeps I'm only in Breath of the Wild wish me luck not to be a coward because I have nothing. <laughs> Don't be a coward, we were all there at some point. Alrighty. 
One more heart and we're off to the Korok Forest. I'm gonna ask for you guys' opinion quick. Should I go for full row, so 15 hearts, and then upgrade my stamina? Or should I start upgrading my stamina now? Or should I... And, and then, eventually, should I upgrade my health all the way and have not very much stamina? Or upgrade my stamina all the way and have, like, less health? I need you guys' opinion. <laughs> I'm gonna do chores for eight months and maybe I'll get your setup. <laughs> the series is almost done. I I don't I don't know if it is though. I I want to um once I actually beat the game, I I wanna go back and do all the DLC quests. Then it might be done. Hey. But there's still a lot to do. So yeah. How much arrows do I have now? Only 78? Aw, lame. Well, goodbye now. Um, get the hearts. Okay. Um, we need to... Okay, so this is Korok Forest, right here. And it looks like there's a road in. So I'm gonna try and follow the road. And see if it, see if it, lets, see if it lets me in. Now, I'm not sure how I'm going to be able to actually do that. I'm not sure how I'm going to get in Quark Forest, because I've heard that there's... Like, you can't just walk in there. But, yeah. Don't go into the mist, or the Quarks will eat you. <laughs> I mean, uh... <laughs> okay, so don't go in the mist. That is good to know. Oh god, the whole forest is nest. Um, okay then. Well, I hope the Koroks don't eat me. Ooh, some hearty truffles it looks like. Those aren't hearty truffles, I'm blind. You know what, come here, come here. Uh, who's your name, Roman? I think his name's Roman. Hey, Roman. And I'm going the wrong way. Ancient saddle for the wind, peeps. Oh, I want to run over the bird. That'd be funny. Try your best, Nick. Here's some advice. When you get the torch, follow it the direction that the little fire particles go. Okay. So is that like the trick to get in? I would assume so. Oh god, this is nasty. Come on, Roman. Oh, I love this sound. Yes, a torch. Oh my god, this is scary. Roman, stay here. I don't want you to get eaten by Koroks. Any advice for your starter channel? Yeah, I've said this many times before, but just, yeah, be original and, yeah, do things that you haven't seen, but people still want. Okay, I'm going to put my torch away, because I'm pretty sure I can just follow these things. Because that would make sense. It's going that way. Oh, hey, Fox. What are you doing? There's a torch over there. Where's this going? This way? I feel like since there's like two here, I need this now. I'm gonna take another torch? No. What if my torch breaks? Am I just screwed? It's telling me to go this way. Oh my god, the trees have mouths. I'm terrified. Ew. This way. This is such a cool. This is such a cool idea. Let's get my monster to 500. Hashtag grow to 500. Yeah. Hashtag grow to 500 people. Woo. Woo. 
Road to 500 hive. Like I was saying though, this game does this this game element. It's just so cool. Like this is really neat. Shrine nearby. I feel like we're going in the same direction for a little while too long. Okay, there. It's changing it up now. That's why it won like 12 awards, lol. It is a really awesome game! We're already at 400 within a few months of 300. Yeah, I know. It's crazy, guys. Ever since that first hundred, we've been zooming by. So yeah, hashtag road to 500 hype. Wednesday, I'm gonna head back to the Great Plateau and see if there's anything more I can unlock. Aren't there like 50 Koroks or something there? Ooh, it's an arch. Whoa. Did we make it? I see a Korok. Yeah, we made it. We made it. 50? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But, whoa, it's lagging. And I set the grass on fire. Why is it lagging so much? This is a switch. Switches don't lag. I don't even have one Korok. Yeah, I... I have, um, six. Alright. Let's get this! Boom. We got a cutscene now. Cool. Link. Lonk. You are our final hope. The fate of Hyrule rests with you. Cool, Zelda. Now give me the sword. Ah! <sighs> Hey, tree. Who is that? Did I doze off again? Hmm. Well, well. It's you. You finally decided to return. Better late than never. After 100 years, I'd nearly given up hope on seeing you again. Even my patience has limits, you know. That look on your face tells me that you have no recollection of me, however. I have watched over Hyrule since time immemorial. Many have referred to me over the ages as the Deku Tree. That is the weapon created by the ancient goddess. The sword that seals the darkness that only the Chosen Knight can wield against the Calamity Ganon. Believe it or not, it was actually you who wielded that sword 100 years ago. But I must warn you to take extreme caution. The sword stands as a test to anyone who would dare attempt to possess it. As you are now, I cannot say whether you are worthy or not. If you sought to free the sword in any sort of weakened state, you would surely lose your life where you stand. Oh my gosh, that's so annoying! <laughs> <laughs> Best of luck, young one. Dude, those Koroks are just adorable. As Wendy from Animal Crossing would say, they're totes adorbs. Yeah, poor guy. <laughs> if you have to pull the sword from its resting place, how much is your true strength? Let us see whether or not you currently possess said power. Oh my gosh. 
Let us save. Just in case you guys are wrong and we die. Yoink. Oh, we can let go? Huh. Why so fearful? Yeah, shut up, Deku Tree. Here we go, guys. Ta da! We did it! Now start stabbing every day. Aw. Woo! Your master will come. We did it, gamers. Until then, you shall rest safely here. Although the slumber of restoration will most certainly deprive him of his memories, please trust me when I say. But I know he will arrive before you yet again. If I may be so bold, what is it that you are planning to do next, Princess? The Master Sword. I heard it speak to me. It seems that my role is unfinished. There is still something I must do. I sense there is great strength in your dedication. Great Deku Tree, I ask of you, when he returns, can you please relay this message? Tell him I... Now then, words intended for him would sound much better in the tones of your voice, don't you think? We did it. Let's go. We have a stabby stab from like a hundred years ago. I'm totally ready to whack some bacoblin booty. Let's do this thing. What you just saw happened where you stand one hundred years ago. After you were separated from the sword, the princess thought to bring it here where she knew that it would be safe under my watch. She continues to fight, trapped deep within the confines of Hyrule Castle. Her heart cascades with faith that you will return. She has a smile like the sun. I would do much to feel its warmth upon me. Once again. Awesome. <laughs> okay, so we can now absolutely. <laughs> Stab people with this sword. Sweet. I'm just going to go get some stuff around here. And I hear that there's a shrine nearby. Blowy Hoppy. It's it's Mr. Hero! Yay! Mr. Hero came to visit us in the forest. What took you so long? Pete's thought of a trial that will make Mr. Hero stronger. You won't have to fight and it's not scary. 
but you'll need to be extra careful. So, I want to see a bloopy. It's a blue, glowy, hoppy thing that glows in the dark. Just about peak size. I just really want to see a bloopy, even if it's a picture of one. Okay, I'll help you out. Huh? Wait, wait, you have it already? Yes, I do, buddy. Wait a minute. Is that a real bloopy? Yes, buddy. Wow, it's even more beautiful than Peaks imagined. Thanks so much, Mr. Hero. Now I'm content. Oh, and here's a little thank you gift. Peaks didn't forget. Money! Oh yeah, Mr. Hero needs rupees sometimes, right? If you desperately need rupees, you should shoot an arrow at a bloopy. I hear they drop lots of rupees if you hit them. Oh man, I'm so glad I got to see something so cool. Peaks is so happy right now. Oh, uh, I like, I like him. I actually have, um, yeah, story time. Story time, I have a, uh, a Korok stuffy. And I named him Peaks. Look at the camera link. Yeah, I named him Peaks, and he is adorable. Uh, I think, um, once I get, uh, my webcam set up on my, um, once I get my webcam set up for streams, I think I'm going to, um, put him on, put him on a stream. Show you guys Peaks, my, my stuffy. Huh, you, could it be? You're Mr. Hero! Mr. Hero is here! The mushroom on my head suddenly sprouted today, so I knew something was up. It was a prediction that you'd come, I think. Us Koroks all got together and prepared some trials just for you, Mr. Hero. Although you may not need them, since you already pulled the Master Sword out and all. But these trials will help you grow even stronger than you are now. Among them is an extra tough one designed by me, the Elder of Korok Forest. So, will you test your metal in the Korok Trials? Do it! You know, if you keep doing everything everyone asks of you without question, you're gonna get conned eventually. Anyway, where was I? Oh yeah, the Korok Trials. Long story short, you need to visit all the shrines in the Korok Forest so you can be considered a real grown-up. Trial 1, in the Southwest Forest. Trial of Second Sight. Trial 2, in the Northwest Forest. The Lost Pilgrimage. Trial 3! In the Eastern Forest, the Test of Wood. If you can overcome the Korok Trials, you can overcome anything. We've also prepared some wonderful prizes for you. Now show us what you're made of. Alright, do your best. Sweet! I guess we might do that maybe, like, later. Ah, <laughs> uh, Mr. Hero, I was watching you pull out the sword. If you want to know more about the sword, leave it to Maka. Okay, about the forest. The highlights here in Korok Forest are the Great Deku Tree and the Sword Pedestal, of course. Although the Great Deku Tree probably isn't very happy about becoming a tourist trap. We've really decked out the inside of the Great Deku Tree in anticipation of your arrival. So wait, you literally cut out the inside of him. That's a little disturbing, but okay. You find a place to rest and a bunch of other useful things in there. And then there's the sword pedestal, the sword that seals the darkness which needs no introduction rests there. The sword pedestal is in the center of fo the forest. If you stand on the pedestal and look around, you'll be able to understand most of the paths in the forest. The bean lamps act as landmarks. You want to familiarize yourself with them to make it easier to find your way around. And if you get turned around, you can always head on back to the sword pedestal. Alright. I got it. Let me see if I eat this stuff. Nothing's gonna come out of them? Fine. Alright then, what's in here? Oh, this is this is the uh, carved out insides of the Great Deku Tree. Hey buddy, useful items here. Oh, look who we have here. Hello Mr. Hero, welcome to the general shop. I sell a lot of stuff here. Things that I gather in the forest, things that I don't gather in the forest. Please choose anything you want. Want to become to sell? Okay, bye. Alright. I'm gonna buy all of his shock arrows. And I'm also gonna buy all of his arrows. Awesome! So now I should have 93 arrows. Awesome. Not what I wanted to do. What is this guy going to say? This is no vegetarians everywhere. What? Stop! That's my face! What the heck, dude? Oh, sorry about that. I must have dozed off for a bit. Oh, ooh, you're Mr. Hero, aren't you? Great Deku Tree told me all about you. So you finally made it to our forest, huh? Been waiting for this for so long, I thought I might start to put down roots. Welcome to the Great Deku Tree's navel. I made a bed out of leaves just for you, Mr. Hero. Take as long as you like with yawns and the Z's. Sleep. How long would you like to snooze? Let's snooze until the morning. Why not, right? Ah ha ha, these guys. 
They're so cute. I love these guys. They're so great. Good morning, you can grab some breakfast next door at the spore store. If you're tired, or even if you're not, come back and get some Z's soon, okay? Oh, yeah, I won't forget, buddy. Oh, hey, Peeks. Are you cold? Why are you shivering? Is Peeks cold? Oh. Oh my gosh, no, I heard him. Why was he shivering? I wonder if the rupees sparkle because they're too full of rupees. Where'd they get all those rupees anyway? Do they make all the rupees in the world? <laughs> huh? You're here, you're here. I've been waiting for you. The great techie tree was right. He said you would come, Mr. Hero. I thought you might be hungry, so I went out and gathered a bunch of forest mushrooms for you. Welcome to the spore store. Mushrooms are delicious, suspicious, but never malicious. Look around, buy something. Or would you rather sell something? Let's sell some stuff. Let's see what we can sell. Mm. Yeah, nothing really good right now. Brid bring anything you don't need to me. It doesn't even have to be a mushroom. <laughs> Let's get some meat skewers while we're at it here. Um, If we grab maybe two gourmets. Oh, stop. What is that going to make? I don't know. Let's just try one for now, actually. One at a time, gonna make... Oh, that gives you six, just for one. So we're gonna have a lot of health from these. Oh, wrong page. And then I'm pretty sure two of the prime ones will give you a six thing meat skewer. So we will do that as well. I'm gonna make a couple of three heart ones as well. Cause sometimes you don't really need that much, but you still want it, right? Makes sense? Yeah, it better. <laughs> and then we'll make another six. Et voila. Awesome. Do I have any more meat? I do not. All right, let's get out of here. This is awesome. We got the master sword, which makes me really happy. So, I think we should go do some of the Korok Trials. Let's do it. Where can we go? Right here. What's this spot mean? It means I'm stuck for some reason. Why can't I walk through here? Who designed this? Okay, fine, whatever. More lag. Kyo Rook Shrine. Oh, there's a shrine over here. Didn't even notice it. I'm blind. <laughs> Alrighty. What is down in the Korok Forest? Fateful stars at the Kyo Rook Shrine. What do we have here? We have looked to the stars for guidance. The constellations are key. What the heck? Ow, my eyes. <laughs> I have no clue. What are we supposed to do here? What does this mean? Well, I'm confused. And I think I might head out unless I can find... A way to do this. Hmm. Well, I'm not sure what to do here, so let's uh, head out. We can come back later. Maybe once I've looked to the stars for guidance, who knows? Chosen one. The heck? The hero called Lonk. The time has come. You're now ready to test the limits of your courage. 
Heat the great Deku's tree at the sick. What? Do so, and a glorious trial will be bestowed upon you. Hmm. EX, trial of the sword. What does that mean? Well, let's see what this has to do with life. And I'm going to take... Oh, it's a tree branch. <laughs> Loser. <laughs> tree branches are losers. Why does this part lag so much? Jeez. Right, what's going on, my guy? My guy? Hmm, what's this? A voice beckoned you here. I see, so the time has come. I should not tell you all I know about the Ardu- uh, 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 something or other that awaits you. The sword that you have reunited with, the Master Sword, it, it is yet to realize its true splendor. The trial shall test your courage to ensure you are worthy of this splendor. It's called the Trial of the Sword. Oh! Yeah, the trial- I didn't know what it was talking about. It will challenge you as you have never been trialed before. Oh my god, the Koroks. All of your weapons and armor will be sealed away. You must face your enemies without the tools you've come to rely on. Once you have tempered your soul and proven your wisdom and courage by completing the trial of the sword, the Master Sword shall truly be yours. Hmm, unless my eyes deceive me, you seem quite willing to take on this trial. A hero through and through. Now, Lonk, place the Master Sword on its pedestal. Don't tell me what to do. Don't tell me what to do, Tree. No. Goodbye. Bye. Have a nice day. <laughs> um, okay. So the plan here, I think I'm gonna actually do this in a video form, The Trial of the Sword, because chat says it's hard, so I'm gonna assume it's hard. And I think I'm gonna do it in video form, and uh, yeah. And then upload it later so I can cut out all the boring bits. Where I'm just redoing the same challenge over and over. Alright, let's make our way to the, um... The Korok Trials. This one over here. Oh, what the heck? No, no, no! Oh, the Koroks are eating me! Oh, yeah, okay. That makes sense. I'm done. Alright. Oh, where am I now? I'm all the way back here. Okay, uh... I need to get to here. So they said that... Oh, my horse is back. Hey, buddy. Oh, what? Oh, hey. Nom. <laughs> Alright, horsey, let's go to, um... Let's go to up here. But, like, we have to follow the Korok paths, because otherwise they eat me. And that's not very nice. It's not a nice thing to do, so just don't do it. Okay, Koroks? Just chill, okay? Yum, 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 yum. We're going away from it, though. I want to do that one. <laughs> Controllers? What are you doing? Okay. I don't know where... Where is the path to get over there? Maybe it's like back here? Does this look like a path? Okay, I'm, a, I'm you're slow, horse, okay? No one likes you. That's kind of mean, but okay. Well, you gotta eat me, Korok, so why can't I just go to the trial? Like a normal person? Frogs, yeah. Okay, here we are. Are you ready? No. Hey, hero guy! I was, to <laughs> I was told you'd be coming. But do you really think you're ready for the test of wood? Some say it's the hardest- oh. Okay, maybe I shouldn't have done that. But it's not complicated. All you need to do is equip this Korok weapon set and reach the shrine at the back of this area. Right? Okay, let's do it. You have to keep the sword, bow, and shield equipped the whole time. If they break or you unequip them, you're out. Your inventory is full. Shut up, guy. 
this is the hardest car on trial. Oh dear. Um, what have I gotten myself into? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna drop this torch, because the only time you really need the torch is, is if they give it to you. And then I need space for a bow, so we'll drop this nearly broken bow. And we'll drop this garbage shield. Alright, buddy. Yeah, 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 I don't care. <laughs> give me the stuff. I am scared. Shouldn't it be easy, though? Or do they spam monsters on you? They probably spam monsters on you. That's just mean. It's supposed to be friendly, dude. All I have to do is reach the shrine. Oh, gosh. Three, two, one, go! Okay, so I have a really crappy bow, but it does shoot three arrows. A really crappy sword. And a really crappy shield. So where's the shrine? Is it gonna not tell me? So I'm just gonna go, I guess. Well, so far, this might be the easiest challenge of them all, lol. Yeah, I know they're gonna spam mobs on me. Hello. So far, this hasn't been too bad. This might be my famous last words, though. Shoot. Wait, what if we use bombs? I love my bombs, they're so useful. See how to make stuff fall. I'm just gonna try and pick up all the stuff. And a boom. Where is the shrine even? Oh shoot, fire thing! Oh shoot, me exploding myself. Good one, mod. Oh god, I want updrafts. Fly away! Oh my god. Load the choo choo. Ow. Um. How am I supposed to do this? What if I walk through here? Does this, like, hurt me? Yeah, I remember that kills me. Why would I do that? Dang it. So, how am I gonna get it? Cryonis. Cryonis. I'm all the way back at the. Okay. Can I get my horse in here? Oh my gosh, I can. What if he dies then? Oh, wait a second. Did I even start the trial yet? I don't think I did. Dang it. I'll never give up. Oh, wait, so the trial did start. Yeah, I ain't giving up. We're going to do this. <laughs> Run like the wind, buddy. Okay, this is the area that we were stuck at before, and I really don't want my horse to die. That is what we're gonna do, isn't it? <sighs> okay. Yeah, I feel like this could be better as <laughs> some kind of montage as well. <laughs> anyway. This horse strategy seemed to work pretty well. We just ride the horse up until we can't. No! No, 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 no! Horse! Huh. Yeah, Craig. 
Baryonis. And yum. Get off the horse. I can't see what's going on. Okay, I think we're gonna have to just beast through this whole thing. Getting hammered. Do I have to keep going through this muck or can I just go this way? There's the shrine. Oh, that wasn't too bad. Go! That was, it was pretty clutch, but that wasn't too bad. Congratulations, you passed the test of wood. Well done, hero man. Happiness awaits you at the shrine. Oh yeah, if you want to do the trial again, just let me know. See ya. Catch you later, nerd. Well, it wasn't too bad. I mean, it wasn't too easy either, but that was a good difficulty. I like that. That was fun. Yeah, Link can take a beating. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting hit left and right there. Hashtag easiest shrine in the game, peeps. We got a giant core too. I wanna upgrade my stasis. I wasn't there. What were the ones that I could upgrade? I know the bombs, the stasis. But wasn't there another one that you could upgrade? Oh yeah, your Sheikah sensor. But I already did that. So I'll have to go back and upgrade that. I could probably do that today too. You've done well to arrive at the shrine, a hero rises to right the wrongs of Hyrule. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I bestow upon you this spirit orb. And somehow gets back on shore after falling into deep mud and lava. <laughs> exactly, yeah. While only losing one health. Spirit orb! Let's go. May the goddess smile upon you. Awesome! And then she vanishes into dust. We're murderers now. Alrighty. So, we... We did that shrine. So I'm happy about that. I'm gonna go, before we forget, back to Hitino Village. which was somewhere, and we're going to upgrade our stasis. And then we'll probably do one last trial before it ends. Yeah, sad face. Yeah, me too. Alrighty. Hello, Pura. Uh, ancient materials. Stasis? Yes. Three ancient cores and a bold snap. Here I go. Snap. Hey, oh, got it. Okay, then, stasis upgrade underway. Guidance stone lock removed. Now, let's do this thing. Here we go. Shiga Slide Authenticated Enhancing Stasis Room. There we go! Stasis Plus. So now we can time stop enemies! Which is gonna be pretty sweet. Actually being able to just freeze things this would have been useful in the last one, wouldn't it have? Could stop some of the Octo Rocks. Yahoo! <laughs> the little guidance stone did the trick. Hee <laughs> hee. What's this? 
Perhaps you already went and powered them all up? Well, I suppose with your Sheikah Slate and your legendary swordsmanship, we have nothing to fear. Yes, quite nothing at all. Not even Calamity again. Well, there we go. Back to Korok Forest, I guess. And yeah, we have two more Quark Trials to do. And then in the next one, I don't really have a plan for the next one even. I mean, I guess there's really only one thing to do now, and that is to get started on, um, on the other, the other, the, the, um, the Gerudo boss. The Gerudo Divine Beast. Forgot what it was called for a little while there. And more lag in the Korok Forest. Just awesome. And then obviously there's the Master Trials too, which we just can't ignore. Alrighty, welcome to the next trial, or I guess we're almost there. Hey, Quark dude. This way to the trial. Eileen seeks to attempt the Quark trial. Is that even allowed? Who cares? Are you here to attempt my Quark trial? Of course. Oh wow, you really want to try it? I guess it was worth asking after all. Let me tell you about the trial. All you need to do is keep going and not get lost in the mist. Easy, right? What's wrong? You don't look very excited. But don't worry, I've got a cryptic little hint for you. The hungry trees will show you the way. Sp spy their iron to win the day. Did I make that sound cool? Think about that as you take on the trial. Okay. So we need to see the iron in the trees. Like this one. There's iron right here. I see iron. Sweet. This shouldn't be too hard. Use magnesis. Oh my gosh, that's a brilliant idea. So I can just... <laughs> Can't do that, yeah. I don't actually see where the next one is, though. I don't want to get too far away, because then the Korok's leaving me. What if I go on top of a tree and try to see it from up there? Oh, the Korok see me. Yeah. Okay, so don't go on top of the trees. Magnesis isn't. Dang it! I couldn't see it. Alrighty. So we see that one over there. It's behind the one with the iron. Back here, you mean? Ah. See it. Okay, now where's the next one? Oh, I think I see something right over there. No! No! Well, at least now we know which way to go for the first couple. Okay, this one's definitely harder than the last one. I can already say that. Okay. 
Now there's a Bokoblin on me. Very first try to use my Master Sword, I guess. That was fun. Aha! Uh -huh. Next one. How much more of this do I gotta do? No, dude! Come on, we gotta get this one. Can't give up now. Said it was back here. Right? I don't see it anymore. Well, yep. Ah! Well, rip. Rip, 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 rip. Dude, I hate this trial. find the next tree anymore. I can't find the next one. Oh, back here. I got it. And then it's up there. And the next one was over here, right? Yes, over here. So we gotta find the next one. Where's the next one? Anyone know? I can't seem to see it with my magnet. Sis? Oh, they're over here. Okay. torches. There's a metal thing up there. What is it? Let's go, Master Sword. What is this? Rusty shield. Feed me the aged shield gar guarded by Monsters Eternal. My brother will repay you in kind. Okay, so this is the rusty shield then. Uh, goodbye forest shield. Rusty shield. Yeah, 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 yeah. Drop. <laughs> Barfs out a treasure chest. And what is that over there? You know what, buddy? You can keep your shield. I don't want it. It's lame. No, no, eat it. Eat it. I know you want it. Yum. Yummy, right? Tastes good? Yeah, thought so. That's what I thought. Now you're dead. Ow! What the heck was that for? Okay, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Goodbye. What is this way? Here's my reward for feeding him rust. Amber. I could have magnesium it. Yeah, you're right. I don't have a Korok leaf to do this, so, um. Oh, there's one right there, but. Nah. What does this say? Place the, my chest in my mouth. The shield eater's brother stole it from me. Hello, 
about Puka Gaming. It is the stream is ending like really soon though, so. Yeah, sorry that you came so late. That sh that chest better not get lost. She's back. Okay. And a thunk. Shrine. See so you're playing with the wild. Yep. Episode 14 already. And yep, here's the shrine. I finished it twice. <laughs> I don't know where. Where did the mag. Where did the. Um. Oh, here it is. Found the shrine. Pretty good game. And we get more free materials. Awesome. Check out the game Link's Awakening. I will take a look at that. I will definitely take a look at that. Oh my gosh, I tried to long jump. What game do I think this is? Stupid me. <laughs> I've been playing a lot of Mario 64 lately. The puzzles are hard. I'm doing it on hard mode, no deaths. Woo! I've seen, I've seen like the game on the eShop, and yeah, it's cool, cool looking. Never actually like fully checked it out, you know. <laughs> well, now we have two spirit orbs already, and we also have another great episode finished. So yeah, um. Yeah, sorry that we have to end so early again, but we made great progress today. Got the Master Sword, and we got two more hearts, which actually means, yeah, we, we got two more Spirit Orbs as well. Uh, look out for a Trial of the Sword kind of montage video coming out later, I'm not sure when, probably in the next two weeks-ish, and... And yeah, uh, streams, remember, Monday, 2 o'clock EST. I will see you guys later. Goodbye.